Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I'm here with a tag video and this is a tag video that's called Makeup Firsts and this is created by Raven Alexandra and I love doing tag videos. I think it's not that popular anymore or is it just me but it feels like not many do um, tag videos or new tag videos but this is actually like one year old but I found it through Anya I will leave her down in the description as well but the creator is Raven Alexandra so this is some questions about my first makeups different things so I think we just get started first question what was your first makeup purchase and hard question I was sitting here and thinking a little bit and it has to be like, if you don't count like lip gloss or like a mascara that I bought when I was maybe like 10, even though I think my mother bought it for me. Or like, you know, a lip gloss that I could wear to discos at school and stuff. I think my first own makeup purchase has to be a black liquid eyeliner. Which is pretty funny because I never use eyeliner anymore. And it has to be that one. And it was Isadora's, it's a Swedish brand, liquid eyeliner, I think it's called. I can put up a picture here. I think those of you who live in Sweden, I am sure that you recognize this. And this is so good. What I can remember, it was so, so good. And should I move that? It was such a good eyeliner and I did my raccoon eyes with it and loved it. So I think that was my first like own makeup purchase, I think. Next question. What item did you fall in love with first? Makeup you binged bought. And it has to be that one. I like couldn't live without it and I remembered one. One morning when I was going to school, I dropped it and it was black everywhere and it like was gone. Uh, so then I always bought like two of them or three of them at the same time. So it, I wouldn't, so I always had at least one at home. So that has to be that one. I didn't use that much makeup before. I started my YouTube channel, honestly. It had interest me, but it was like never a thing that I thought I was going to do. So yeah, it has to be that I learned as well. Next up, product you hated at first but love now. I'm not that picky with products. Or am I? But okay, a product that I have now that I first hated. I don't actually know if I have any of these products in my collection. I'm thinking like, do I have any eyeshadow palettes? But I don't think I do. No powders, no foundations, no primers. No. Okay, if I'm thinking about something that I didn't like that much in the beginning. It feels like I've talked about things, but what the hell have I talked about? Okay, so something I... Maybe I didn't hate it, but I didn't like it in the beginning. Because I didn't know... I didn't had find my way to use this. And it's the Nip and Fab Fix Sticks Definition. It is a contour stick. I really like this one. In the beginning I thought it was so hard to like get it good. I don't know, I'm not an expert right now, but I I really like it. I have it on today. Um and I think it's really good. And I was like a little bit iffy about it <laughs> at first when I tried it, but now I really like this one. Next up, uh when did you start wearing makeup? Okay, so I started with like my eyeliner when I was 13. I think 13 or 14 and then I started to fill in my brows when I was 20, 
23 or 24. And then this thing, um, maybe two years ago, but like a full face and things like that, maybe six years ago. Yeah, I think six years ago I started with like a real face. I think at least. Maybe I have answered something else in a tag video that I have done before with like kind of the same similar question. But yes, my memory, I don't know. I think maybe six years ago. Okay, so this is a question that is hard for me to answer. Um, I have to switch switch it out, but it is Sephora or Ulta, which did you go to first? I have never been in Ulta because it's only in US, but in Sweden we have a beauty store that is called Kix. So I maybe can take Sephora or Kix. And I actually think it was Sephora, but it wasn't Sephora in Sweden. When I was 14, I think, I was on a school trip to Paris and then some of the people that I went to class with and was in France with or in Paris with, they loved makeup. So we went into a Sephora and I didn't get it because I did my raccoon eyes at a time. So I think Sephora was my first. But I must have been to Kix before that. But what the hell did I buy at Kix? I have no idea. So yeah, I think Kix. But like my first memory of being in a really like a beauty store is Sephora in Paris. I just remember, I think it was so much stuff everywhere. I didn't like it. Okay, the first high-end brand you bought from. And I think it must have been makeup store that it is, is a Swedish brand and it is high-end, at least in my world. First, afford affordable brand you bought from and that has to be Isadora. They are affordable or maybe... What did I try in the beginning? No, it has to be Isadora. I bought like more stuff from Isadora. Like I think I got an eyeshadow and a pressed powder. So yeah, Isadora. Next question. First go-to look. Raccoon eyes. Period. Then I like evolved my style and did a star underneath my eye. And then I did two stars. And then I just made dots under my eye. So that was my first go-to look. Okay, next up, first makeup memory. And this I know that I have answered before and I don't remember what I answered. I think I have answered a question like this. But my first makeup memory, I can like remember when I was, I don't know how old I could have been, like 10 or something before a disco. Is it even called disco? Like a party for children when you are in like middle school not middle school maybe middle school um i was around 10 maybe and like putting on my blue mascara that i had putting on my favorite lip gloss that smelled like apple i think that maybe is like my first memory and like you know when you feel like this is cool and i am cool and I love this glass and this mascara, it looks cool. I think that is my first makeup memory. Who was your first makeup inspiration? Family, friends, celeb, etc. Um, I had a friend when I was younger. She started with like raccoon eyes and I also wanted to do that. So I think she was my first like inspiration to become like an emo kid. I was not that emo, but a little emo. So yeah, it was a friend of mine. And now my inspiration is a lot of my YouTube friends. But yeah, one of my best friends when I was younger was my inspiration. Okay, and the last question. First favorite brand. And okay, my first favorite brand, I think it has to be a makeup store. 
because like with makeup store I discovered makeup in a way like I bought a foundation and I bought highlighter and a blush and eyeshadows so I think makeup store was my first like favorite brand where I like felt that this is something this is fun it was not like this at all like I look now but it was like the first brand I was really interested in I like wanted to buy new eyeshadows so yeah makeup store and yes that was all for this tag I really hoped you liked it and don't forget to check out Raven Alexandra that is the creator of this tag and also Anya I will leave them both down in the description and their videos and also all the questions and I tag all of you that see this I think it's fun to talk about older stuff and like where your makeup journey started and it's so fun to hear when people started to do makeup I was pretty late like with this kind of makeup and like with foundation and a base and everything I think I was kind of late because I was 20 something like 25 I think can't remember but I think around that time but yeah I really hoped you liked this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope I'll see you in the next one bye